In this video, we're going to be watching a video by Masahiro Sakurai about exercising with games. I think this is pretty relevant to the channel, and if you don't know who Masahiro Sakurai is, basically he's Kirby's dad and also the director of the Super Smash Bros games. So he's got a lot of importance in the gaming world, and he started a really cool channel which is creating games with Masahiro Sakurai, and yeah, he just does different topics from different games. So we're going to have a little watch and a little listen together, and I'm going to put my input in as a personal trainer. There we go, Masahiro Sakurai on creating games. And and let's go. Another grab from the old bag. Oh, grab so bag. Yeah. Combines his gaming and exercise into one activity. That's pretty interesting. Let's see what he does. Oh, okay, cool. 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 Yeah, yeah. Let's pause it right there. So Pedaling while you're playing a game, taking your mind off of it. Absolutely, there are studies that show having some sort of input, whether it be audio, listening to music, or you know, distracting yourself playing a game, can dampen pain signals. I actually met some guys from uh, GameTherapy.com who were talking about this. So it was being used for children, you know, using video games to distract children who are in hospital from the pain and the anxiety that they are feeling, obviously, in such an awful situation. It's a very similar sort of concept here. You're playing a video game, and you're exercising, it's blocking out the pain signals, you're distracted by the video game, you are exercising for longer. Anyway, cool, it's good. You can keep going for hours, yeah. Nice one. So much personality. Racing games and using pedaling for it. There's actually someone who made like a ring fit bike mod using the Labo uh, for Mario Kart. Uh, it's really cool. I'll try and have a look at that at some point. But yes, um, there is definitely a thing there where you unconsciously go slower if you're in a quieter part or when you're in an intense part, you will go faster. ゲーム yeah, that's a pretty cool one, using light aerobic exercise for a period of time whilst watching content. It's not specifically playing games, but you can do that. I, that's why you get a lot of treadmills and uh, aerobic, um, what do you call them, elliptical trainers that have TV screens now and you can like load Netflix onto them and you can watch something while you're exercising just as a way of distracting you and making you exercise for longer. Sakurai。Interesting. I wonder what his source is. I mean, it's good to exercise in general, but yeah. コロナ禍により、ジムを辞めてしまったりして、不摂生しがちになっています。Good man. That's fantastic. I wonder if he's sponsored. That's solid, actually. I also was doing that in the pandemic. I was using the stairs for walking up and down in my apartment building. And I also, um, I was also like using it for uh, calf raises. When you're doing a calf raise, you raise up, yeah? Fantastic. So what's happening at that point is that your gastrocnemius and your soleus, they are contracting. Excellent. And then when you go down, obviously they go eccentric. So they're lengthening, but you actually have a larger range of movement. So if you do it on a step, right? So you've got your step, then you can, instead of just using this range of motion, you can go down here 
and you can get a full range of motion that's going to help you with strengthening it's going to help protect your achilles tendon as well now this was told to me by a physiotherapist who worked with the british olympic team at beijing and he was helping me recover from an injury uh, it's a guy that i knew through my work at the time and yeah essentially like it helps 90 percent of his clients uh it helps protect their achilles tendons and it stops them from having to come back to him which is a really really good thing so that's why if you're doing a calf raise do it off a step it's going to really help so use your apartment stairs if you've got them or a set of stairs outside or just a normal gym step 500 steps wow that's a lot <laughs> good stuff I've also gone overboard and hurt my legs. That's called being old, man. Good man. So yeah, what a what a nice little video. Masahiro Sakurai, such a genuine, lovely person. I would love to meet him, uh, but that's not the point. I think that was pretty good. Obviously, he's a high-end game developer, but he clearly takes his health quite seriously. I remember vaguely there was a story about him actually passing out whilst exercising. It was to do with blood sugar or blood pressure or something like that. He takes his health quite seriously and using low-key aerobic exercise whilst you're watching TV or playing a game or something is actually a really good idea. I actually recommended this to some clients recently because I believe that it has some benefits in letting you have a little bit of you know fun time but also getting just a little bit of aerobic exercise in is going to be good for your health in general. It's going to be good for your cardiovascular system. Keeping that healthy obviously extends your life for the most part so that's really good it wants to keep you healthy for a longer time and distracting yourself from the pain as i mentioned earlier in the video is definitely a good thing so having some music on is my normal one but you know i'll play games whilst having a walk that's why i play pokemon go that's actually a really good reason why pokemon go and pikmin bloom because they actually distract you from how long you've walked last week i walked 63 kilometers playing pokemon go and i didn't realize it so it's pretty mad right um you can do some really really crazy stuff with it so uh, definitely a good Thing to play games whilst you're exercising and i think that video was really good getting a wider gaming audience the idea of exercising whilst playing games and i think that's fantastic obviously i want more people to play ring fit but anything is going to be good animal crossing is actually a really good passive one um and i quite enjoy walking every step when i'm hatching eggs in pokemon if i'm shiny hunting or something like that so that's another cool one for you but anyway so from a personal training standpoint i think that's really cool just a really good passive exercise method for you so definitely good stuff from me i hope he does more stuff about exercise It'd be really interesting to see his take on like ring fit or fitness boxing or something like that considering fitness boxing definitely quite big in japan so that'd be really interesting anyway thank you so much for watching i am going to be doing more content like this on this channel so if there's anything you want my opinion on any videos chuck a link down in the comments let me know what it is and yeah i can do some reaction stuff that'd be really cool maybe i'll turn it into a stream who knows anyway thank you so much for watching thank you to my patrons like rain i love waffles 1311 and sick hippie for the amazing support through patreon i said support wrong there but that's not the point Thank you for the support through Patreon. Really appreciate it, especially whilst I am in this post-COVID recovery system. Have a wonderful day. I'm Master Trainer Peter, of course, and I'll see you in the next video.